Republican senators like South Dakota's Mike Rounds are unified in their defense of former President Trump. Our message has been that it's not constitutional to try to impeach, and there's no reason to impeach uh, someone who has already left office. In addition, some Republicans don't want Democrats to call any witnesses for the impeachment trial, saying if they do, Republicans will call for FBI testimony, which they say will show the Capitol riot was planned independently from anything Trump said. Trump's legal team argues he isn't to blame for the riot and also wants to stop Democrats from using any video of the Capitol riot. But Democrats like Senator Debbie Stabenow say the video makes the case clear. And um, the questions uh, about what the president did are very uh, visible on videotape. However, Democratic Virginia Senator Tim Kaine worries there won't be enough senators who vote to convict Trump in an impeachment trial. I'm very worried about going through this trial and having the punchline at the end being Trump acquitted again. That's why he would rather censure the former president. Susan Collins and I have come up with a very reasonable bipartisan approach that would condemn Donald Trump, that under the 14th Amendment would bar him from ever running again. But Kane says there's not enough bipartisan support for a censure either, because Republicans don't want to stop Trump from running for office, and Democrats are set on an impeachment trial. In Washington, Alexandra Limon.